Hi everyone, welcome back. I'm Brian, and now you're listening to Code Upcast. What's up, everyone? In this episode, we're going to hear story from someone. He is a developer from Bali. His name is Teta. So, wanna hear more about him? Let's hear out. It's time to dev story fishing. Hello, everyone. My name is Teta, junior web developer, uh, working at Orbit, a digital agency in Bali. I think that's that's it. Hi, Data. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm good. First of all, I want to say thank you so much for your time to have this conversation. So glad you can make it. Thanks again. Yep. So what's keeping you busy these days? Yeah, uh, back in these days, I'm just working on web development uh-huh. and do some small projects. Uh, just fun project, not really making some money, but yeah, it's a fun project, I think. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, I see. <laughs> so, Data, tell me, how do you become a software developer? I mean, your journey to become a developer? Okay, uh, at first, I'm just uh, just exciting how the game's working in the back end. Okay. And in high school, I start just uh, searching on Google how the things works on these uh-huh. games and okay. start working, uh, you know, Game Maker? Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I start creating uh, simple games like Batman and just change the monster face with uh, my teacher. <laughs> And uh, I changed the the character, the main player with my face and like uh, the teacher chasing me to catch me around the arena in Petsman. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what else? And then after that, I start like uh, understanding uh, how the games work. So I, I need to learn something called programming uh-huh. language. Uh-huh. And then I searching on the Google what is the most easiest programming language and the most of result is uh, Java. Uh, <laughs> it's good for beginner, okay. but it's a little hard, but uh, it's good basic for beginner and mm-hmm. start buying some books on Gramedia, uh, Java book. Uh, and okay. the most fun program that uh, I created on that book is how to count how long to takes a human go to the moon. <laughs> <laughs> and then I just leaving programming for a while because Uje National, what is in English? National guess, yes, okay. Yeah, so I leave it for a while. And then after graduated from high school, uh-huh. I start to uh, going to college in Sticky Indonesia. And this become fun journey in college because I met another people who has uh, same passion with me and start sharing uh, what's going on on the developer in the global and what do you do on your project. Uh-huh, okay. uh, like uh, we have created a project that what we can solve in our community. And then uh, I have a friend that have a simple idea, but that looks like uh, exciting okay. to do. There's a portal for all organization in campus. So all of the people can join on that and share information uh, what's what's in, going on in our college what is a uh, uh, job listing that they have to share oh okay that's just running for one year after after one semester and uh-huh. there's no one want to continue for that <laughs> this okay. is just a simple website that okay, has information to share uh, with people in college I think and then I got an uh, internship on a uh, trust tech company called Gringo. Ah, I can see, see. Hey, Gringo and start learning uh, Ruby on Rails because ah, okay. <laughs> they okay. are must using Ruby on Rails. But I didn't know that they are using Ruby on Rails, but they, yeah. they are accepting oh, me to join the internship and yeah, teaching me how to using to develop in Ruby on Rails. And then, yeah, I learning some back-end stuff from that. Okay. After creating some front end on the before project uh-huh. on college that I said before, and learning how to using NoSQL, yeah, 
In Stolitz, hmm. uh, the lecturer teach me how to use uh, SQL, SQL? Yeah, okay. so uh, like relational database. And but in my internship, they okay. teach me to using no relational database. There's a lot of learn on that. <laughs> <laughs> it's really quite hard, you know. Yeah, no SQL. Yeah. Okay. So what else? And then yeah, uh, I will intern for like uh, three months and to continue to get thesis for prepare my last semester and then yeah i've graduated uh -huh. after that uh, i get called from the gringo uh, okay. uh, that's uh, my place there uh, uh, okay. i in have internship before and then uh, they asked me their their friend called outbit uh, that's okay. I, where I'm working now. They want to hire people with uh, basic front end and some basic oh, with QGIS okay. framework. And yeah, that's a good time because I am learning QGIS too. And they are hiring for the QGIS. So oh, yeah, okay. that's how I met my jobs now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wow, well, that's interesting. So you're working with Vue right now? Uh, no. But in like three months, I'm working on that using Vue that is on uh, open source project they have. Okay. It's called Tanam. There's uh, CMS using uh, Vue.js for the front end okay. and uh -huh. back end using Firebase. So you can create a CMS like a blog, but by, uh, more, okay. more feature using the code. HTML, but just only uh, three months using QGS. After that, we changed that to Angular oh, because okay. my lead using Angular and we have the senior on using Angular. So <laughs> we changed to that. At ah. first, we were using QGS, but the the lead okay. on project, the lead project of that is uh, like quit from our team. And so we need a lead to continue that. We need uh, using Angular because after uh, the leader before quit, so our leader now using Angular, so we change that to the Angular. So that's how we meet at the Angular conference. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Angular Revolution yeah. conference. That's why I got, that's how I got the scholarship, so because proposing using that open source project. Okay, oh. And now, now I'm continuing using React. <laughs> <laughs> React, okay. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Avatar now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Because, yeah, that why uh, I'm using React because that open source uh, just pen pending for now. Ah, uh huh. Because we have uh, more priority on the other project from our clients, so we keep keep on that now. Oh, okay. And that's using React, and yeah, I'm here now using React. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but maybe later you can come back to Angular. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I miss on that because, <laughs> uh, like, yeah, React, like, all of your code is JavaScript, and yeah, that's so uh, blowing my mind. <laughs> okay. So, your first project that you create back then is your website when in campus. Yeah, that's all, that's all just simple portal information. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. That's not using framework. That's only oh, it's, PHP it's and PHP, yeah, right? HTML basic front end. Okay, so what is your the most favorite language? Yeah, after I'm trying using like Ruby on Rails, okay. uh, I try a little bit for Python too. Uh -huh and javascript uh i have been uh, on three languages okay. like ruby on rails javascript php and okay. java so oh yeah php too <laughs> okay. wait there's more okay, i think yeah. oh, php well, ruby wow. javascript python and uh oh. yeah i think only that's four so most favorite i think is javascript javascript I think, yeah, yeah. Okay. Everybody loves because it. Because I'm mostly use, uh, working on front end. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, I love it because, yeah, uh, you know, you you can create back end too using JavaScript and front end, like, yeah. You don't need to learn more. <laughs> ah, okay. How about native languages like Android? Or... I have been on there before. 
on mobile. Ah, okay. So, what are your tips for being a happy and productive uh, developer? Yeah, there's all day is not happy day, I think. <laughs> Sometimes you get down too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, uh, not happy yeah, day. Yeah, there's just... Yeah, one week and there's there's seven days. Uh, okay. just not uh only happy, but sometimes I get down too. <laughs> sometimes uh, uh you uh I think for the tips is just keep coding. I think uh because okay the I yeah I can I cannot say uh we all, we must always happy for developer because yeah we have some uh mental illness too <laughs> <laughs> okay. yeah uh, we like uh, how to solve the problem how to we get out of this error and yeah how to communicate with client and our teams too how to keep our mind cool ah uh, okay beside coding uh what else uh, do you Uh, do usually playing games? Usually, I'm yeah, I'm playing games too. But uh, because I have I have been eight hour on screen, okay. but, yeah, I'm just do a little bit gaming, like just yeah, ten uh, minutes or fifteen minutes, and then do socialize things, talk to human, <laughs> <laughs> okay, and do okay. do uh, some sports like uh, futsal or badminton. Yeah, just getting ah, outside. Okay, this part. Just put your toilet. Ah, okay. <laughs> so, what are your hopes and your dreams for the next? I have a dreams. I become a senior developer. Yeah, there's just uh, not uh, specific things how to become senior. What is senior developer? But okay. senior developer is just like you know how to architecture and build how. With a sustainable uh, software, then that's for long term. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Just because uh, I'm a junior developer, uh, I, I know how to code, but I, I didn't know how to keep this on the long run, I think. Okay, oh, that's yeah. good. Oh, that's... I think that's dreams, my dream for now, or my New Year resolution, I think. <laughs> <laughs> so, what, what about your hopes? I'm just going, just going on, <laughs> but... Yeah, uh, okay. I have a hope. I hope that uh, there is no framework again on the front end. <laughs> just keep just okay. keep only three frameworks, and I I get not for spell, you know, spell JS. Yeah, yeah, there's a new, JS. Like yeah. there's a new competitor. There's four front end, like and the, that that keep us programmer uh, arguing what is good, what is bad, and there's no how <laughs> you know. Yeah, I see. And I like community too. Okay. I like to share. I like to uh, uh-huh. meet meet new people and learn from them and share uh, how, what I tough, what they tough about the technology because yeah, it's growing so fast. Uh-huh. And yeah, I hope I can be a GDA. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I mean, so thank you so much, Data, for your time. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay, thanks Hello. again. I mean. I'm so glad you can make it. So maybe in another episode, we can talk another another discussion. Yeah. So thank you so much for your time. Okay. Give a plug. Thank you. See you. See you. Good luck for your career, Data. So that's it for today. Thanks for listening. See you in the next episode. I'm Raihan. Have a good day. Hope you're doing well. Stay healthy and salam. Bye bye. Peace. <laughs>